Hello everyone and uh, thank you for uh, tuning into this video. This is Sean and uh, here I'm going to be talking about the uh, characteristics of the Moon and Scorpio personality. What is it like? How does it resonate with uh, those born with it? Now the Moon and Scorpio individual can be uh, quite uh, profound. They can be uh, pretty mysterious. Um, now the moon, when it is in the sign of Scorpio, it's actually considered to be in its fall, meaning that uh, it's not the greatest placement for the moon to be in because uh, there's so much emotional intensity. Um, there's an aura of mystery surrounding these uh, people, but uh, nevertheless, it can uh, actually be, be pro quite powerful and um, these uh, individuals have uh, deep psychic and uh, intuitive gifts. And um, they, are natural, they can be natural psychologists too. They uh, are able to read uh, people like a book. Um, they can uh, get a deep sense of uh, who they are just uh, simply by observing them. And um, they uh, are able to... Uh, look uh, deep into uh, the thoughts of other people. So um, if you're on, you are around a moon in Scorpio person, um, you may be uh, quite uh, uplifted and uh, inspired just by their mere presence. Now the moon represents emotions, feelings, and the mother, whereas the sign of Scorpio, it uh, rules uh, the concepts of taboo, sexuality, intimacy, mystery, and death. So when uh, somebody has a, a moon in Scorpio placement, they uh, have the uh, emotional need to um, develop their uh, sexual powers. Um, their, uh, they have an emotional need to uh, to be intimate with the uh, right person and um, they uh, also have the emotional need to um, discover the uh, true uh, meaning of life. They uh, want to discover uh, the deep esoteric uh, secrets of uh, what it is to uh, live in this uh, universe in reality. The Moon and Scorpio person is very, very selective in uh, choosing a partner. Um, when it comes to relationships, they uh, may not be the most uh, trusting individuals. That's because they have uh, such a layer to them that uh, is so deep and profound. And um, it will take a lot of uh, effort getting to know um, this uh, kind of person. They're not uh, the most trusting people in the world and uh, it takes uh, a lot of effort to uh, gain their uh, friendship and trust. Once, uh, however, a Moon and Scorpio person does decide to um, tr trust you enough, uh, they'll uh, open uh, up to you completely. They will um, talk about things that uh, other uh, moon signs find uh, quite uh, uncomfortable to deal with, such as, um, you know, the typical uh, Scorpio uh, ideas of uh, sexuality, intimacy, um, the deeper meanings of life. Um, uh, just, um, yeah, they are quite uh, comfortable in uh, discussing these matters with others who they uh, trust. A Moon and Scorpio person may not uh, have the uh, greatest sympathy for those who have uh, double-crossed them. Uh, they're probably the least forgiving of all the uh, Moon signs. So uh, if you uh, double-cross uh, this kind of person in any way, if uh, you deceive them, if you lie to them, um, if uh, you are in a relationship with them and if you cheat on them watch out because you will certainly regret it you will certainly uh, feel their wrath and uh, yeah it can be quite traumatizing these um, people may have had a uh, mother 
who was uh, very tyrannical, uh, very dictatorial, very uh, controlling and uh, manipulative towards them. They uh, may not have allowed uh, their children to uh, seek uh, the freedom that they need to uh, discover themselves. Um, a moon in Scorpio individual can be uh, quite uh, mani manipulative. Um, they, uh, since they are able to read the um, hidden motives and uh, psychological traits of another person, um, they uh, can be quite uh, cunning and uh, deceiving themselves. So, um, yes, it's best uh, not to um, mess with these uh, people too much. Uh, otherwise, uh, yes, as I've mentioned, you will regret it and uh, it won't be pretty. Since Scorpio is a sign of death and rebirth, the moon in Scorpio uh, person is likely to uh, undergo a deep uh, transformation while they're uh, growing up. Um, they uh, may have uh, suffered deep uh, psychological traumas um, that um, will uh, endure for the rest of their lives. And um, they um, find it uh, rather difficult, uh, I feel, that uh, to express um, their pains, their traumas, and uh, their deep uh, psychological hurts that uh, have been inflicted upon them earlier in life. Um, as they uh, grow older, and when they find uh, somebody that they uh, love and uh, trust enough to uh, spend the rest of their lives with, they will uh, gradually uh, learn to open themselves uh, up further. By releasing all this uh, negative uh, tension and uh, past hurt, they are um, transforming them themselves and uh, undergoing a rebirth into a uh, positive um, force that who can um, better serve um, humanity. These people are natural born detectives and psychologists. They uh, want to probe deep into the matter of uh, any uh, situation that uh, is very important to them. And uh, they uh, are uh, highly developed uh, in uh, getting to the uh, root of any uh, situation. The tarot card that best symbolizes uh, the moon and Scorpio energy is death. Now, um, it's quite funny how um, in preparation for this video, when I was uh, going through this deck to uh, look for this card, this was the very first card that uh, popped up. So, <laughs> quite the uh, synchronicity. Now, uh, in um, the tarot, death, uh, the death card represents uh, change, uh, deep uh, transformation, uh, rebirth. Um, getting rid of uh, what no longer serves. And um, throughout the uh, life of a Moon and Scorpio individual, that's uh, what they're constantly uh, dealing with. Uh, change, uh, rebirth, uh, regeneration. And um, yes, quite, um, it's quite, this is card is, I believe is uh, quite symbolic of um, the Moon and Scorpio energy. The moon in Scorpio person could care less what others think of him or her. Um, they are able to uh, stand on a, their own uh, two feet and uh, they are very resilient people. They're uh, very resourceful. They're very uh, intelligent and intuitive. And um, yes, their, um, their life uh, is uh, a constant struggle. Um, they're always uh, battling uh, deep, uh, powerful emotions uh, within uh, their own psyche. And they're uh, constantly uh, striving to achieve the uh, best that they can possibly be. Now, perhaps the ideal uh, partner for a Moon in Scorpio person would that, 
would be uh, that of uh, Taurus, since uh, Scorpio is uh, in opposition to uh, the zodiac sign of Taurus. So they want uh, someone who is uh, loyal, steady, um, stable, and uh, able to be, provide uh, good nurturing energies towards him or her. Once they have found uh, something uh, to pursue, they will uh, pursue it with uh, all of their uh, energy, emotion, and uh, power. Celebrities born with Moon in Scorpio include Beyonce, Ben Affleck, Ryan Reynolds, Bruce Lee, and Lady Gaga. So uh, this has been my uh, perspective on uh, what it's like to have uh, the Moon in Scorpio placed in one's uh, astrological chart. I do uh, hope you were satisfied with the uh, level of explanation uh, provided in this video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. This is uh, Sean, and I do want to thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day wherever you are. Uh, God bless you, and uh, let me just close by saying uh, peace, much love, and uh, namaste. You're wonderful. Thank you so much. Have a wonderful day.